Hey guys, Ginger here. Welcome back to my channel and today I'm bringing you guys my September TBR. Well, I actually can't talk about a lot of the books that I'm reading in September. Whoops. Um, but that is for a good reason. I am doing a secret TBR for the month. So, um, some of those books are back here and you can't see them. So, haha, -ha, jokes on you. <laughs> but, um, uh, I do have a couple books and, uh, things that I'm going to talk about in this video. So it's going to be short, very different from my wrap up, which is pretty long this month <laughs> or this past month. Um, but I will talk to you guys about the books that I can tell you guys about that I want to read this month. So first and foremost, wait, wait a second. I actually have two books that I need to read. Two. Two arcs because I got an e-arc. Anyway, okay. So first and foremost, we have an arc that comes out in October and I am super excited about this one. I would really like to wait for actually October to read this, but I like to read my arcs a month in advance so I can tell you guys about them before they come out as I just think is appropriate for an arc. Um, and so I'm going to be reading The Furies by Katie Lowe and this is a witchy novel. I am super excited and I'm so grateful to the publishers for sending this my way. And this comes out on October 8th. So I'm planning to read it in September so I can tell you guys about it in my wrap up. Um, I'm really, really excited about this. All I know is that it's witchy and it's like, um, has like a boarding school-esque vibe or just like a school-esque vibe. So I'm I'm really really excited. The blurb says a modern tale of witchcraft, betrayal, and murder. An edge of your seat thriller that will terrify as well as enchant. So witchy thriller is totally up my alley and I'm super excited to read this. And then the other advanced reader copy that I would like to get to very soon because it actually comes out in September but I just got it in my email is Violet um by the author I will put the picture here um and this is a horror novel that I um had requested a print copy but they didn't have enough but they were kind enough to send me an e-arc so I will be reading that and Violet is like my favorite name ever and when I have my daughter that's her that's going to be her name um so that obviously intrigued me and then knowing that it was a horror novel intrigued me so I definitely ask for that and this author also wrote Kill Creek and that is one that is on my radar um so I'm excited to see how this how this ends up because obviously I'm excited for it or else I wouldn't have requested it and then I'm also going to be I'm actually going to be hopefully completing two readathons or participating in two readathons this month but the first one begins tomorrow which is September 1st and that is the Raven Cycle readathon so I will be reading the Raven Boys starting tomorrow and finishing it this coming week hopefully. I have so many books that I have to read tomorrow but hopefully I'm gonna start with this one so I can read some of my other books that I have to read this month um, because then we will also be reading The Dream Thieves, Blue Lily Bl Lily Blue, and then The Raven King all throughout the month of September. I have never read this series but uh, I trust books in Lala's opinion so I'm going to give it a try and I will be vlogging my experience reading this so you guys can look forward to seeing that at the end of the month if you are interested. And all I know is that there are a group of dudes and a main character named Blue and there's some magical elements in here. So that is that is how I'm going into this series only knowing that stuff. But I am excited to see if I like this. I have not had any desire to pick this up until now that they're doing the readathon, so hopefully I enjoy it. And then I'm also planning to participate in Contemporary Thon, but that is happening at the end of the month, so I have given that TBR zero thought. Um, I just know I would like to do it, but I have other books that I need to read before then, or else I might not be doing it. So if I do participate in this round of contemporary thon which would be my first round of participating in ever I know exciting um I will be putting that TBR up later in the month closer to those dates um because I'm probably going to be getting a lot of those books from the library because um I know one of the prompts is a 2019 release and I don't have any contemporary 2019 releases so we're gonna have to visit the library for that and then the last book I'm gonna share with you guys is a part of my secret TBR and I decided I was going to share one of them with you guys because I think that you'll be excited to know that I am reading it this month and that is A Court of Thorns and Roses by Sarah J Maas. I'm finally reading this book. 
Um, but for why and what purpose, you guys will have to wait and find out. I'm nervous. I'm not gonna lie. I know that this is probably one of the biggest loved books on booktube, so I am excited and nervous to see what I think about it. And hopefully you guys don't come for me if I don't like it. So a little mysterious TBR for the month and a few books that you know I'm planning to read. But I'm gonna leave it that way so you guys look forward for my secret video that I'm hoping to post at the end of the month before my wrap up. Um, but yeah, let me know in the comments below what you guys are planning to read in September. Let me know if you're also participating in any readathons, um, whether they be the ones I'm participating in or other. Uh, I was thinking about participating in the Avatar readathon, but I just know that it's not going to be a realistic possibility for me, so we're going to put that off. Um, but it's still a really good idea, and I would definitely recommend you check it out if you're interested in that. But thank you guys so much for watching. If you like this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button to see more of my content in the future. But until that future, I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!